This automobile manufacturer is the definition of luxury. It was the year 1904. In Manchester, UK, two partners by the name of Henry Royce and Charles Rolls came together to introduce a luxury car brand. Little did they know that 180 years from then, Rolls-Royce will still be a prestigious brand untouchable by the rest of their unachievable quality, durability and luxury and most importantly customizability. Stick around to the end as we uncover amazing facts about this elegant and luxurious automobile brand. Fast fact, of all the cars manufactured in the history of Rolls-Royce, 65% are still in use and this is how the brand's story began. Henry Royce was running his own company, an electrical and mechanical business. In 1904, he made his very first car, consisting of two cylinders named the Royce 10. While Charles Rolls was an owner of a motor car dealership, C.S. Rolls & Co., impressed by the Royce 10, on the 23rd of December 1904, Charles went into an agreement with Henry. There were to be four car models, and Charles would purchase all the cars Henry could put together. The four models range from 10 horsepower two cylinder to 15 horsepower three cylinder to 20 horsepower four cylinder and finally to 36 horsepower six cylinder. It was also agreed that Charles was to be the sole seller of the models and each car purchased would be branded as Rolls Royce. The very first car was released and was labeled as the Rolls Royce 10 horsepower and was sold at 395 pounds. Yes. The very first car from the Rolls-Royce was a 1.8-litre two-cylinder with a top speed of 63 kilometres per hour. Fast fact, a total of 16 units were made of the very first Rolls-Royce. 118 years later, four of the 16 survived. One belongs to the UK Science Museum collection, two are believed to be owned by two private collectors and the final one belongs to Bentley Motors. In March 1906, the partners officially merged and Rolls-Royce Limited was born and by December the company offered shares worth £100,000 to the public. They soon began the manufacturing of a newer model, one that was more powerful than the existing 30 horsepower six-cylinder. The newer and improved six-cylinder was the 4050 horsepower. It was nicknamed the Silver Ghost and within a year it was famously known as the best car in the world. Fast fact, as World War I came into effect, Rolls-Royce manufactured the Rolls-Royce Eagle, a 12-cylinder aero engine. It was this Eagle that powered the first direct transatlantic flight and the first flight from England to Australia. Post-World War I, the Silver Ghost demand shrank. This led Rolls-Royce to manufacture the 20 in 1922, much more affordable in price. The real uprising of Rolls-Royce was with the introduction of the 4050 Phantom, which paved the way for over 6,000 units to be built. Over the years, Rolls-Royce was noticing the presence of a potential competitor. As the years passed and the Great Depression hit, this competitor was not battling well with the crisis. Who is this mysterious rivalry? Bentley. Into the early 1930s, Rolls-Royce acquired Bentley and closed the chapter of the new Bentley 8-liter the competitor to the Phantom. However, under the new Rolls-Royce management, Bentley began doing surprisingly well. With the Second World War now in effect, Rolls-Royce began focusing more on the manufacture of aero engines. The Rolls-Royce Merlin and the Rolls-Royce Griffin soon became very engaged in aero engineering manufacturing process, even post-war, so much so the aero engines took the position from automobile manufacturing for generating most revenue of the company's business. Rolls-Royce developed to become Britain's 14th largest company in terms of manpower, home to 80,000 employees. Walking into 1971, battling powerful financial competition to acquire the RB211 contract, their success was soon questionable as financial instability broke loose. Beginning to create the RB211 turbofan after government provided cash subsidies, Rolls-Royce willingly entered receivership in 1971 as a result of running out of its funds and resources. Rolls-Royce was in liquidation. Under the receiver, the company began focusing more on automobile manufacturing with both diesel and petrol engines. 
A year later, a total of 8,166 employees were employed in both divisions. Walking in 1973, Rolls-Royce Motors was floated as a separate entity and many new board members took control and responsibility. A few years later, the shareholders of the company agreed to merge with Vickers Limited and in 1987, the company went private as they offered the government to buy back its shares. A few years later, Vickers had planned to sell Rolls-Royce Motors. BMW offered to pay £340 million, but Volkswagen bid higher at £430 million. Even though Volkswagen purchased the company, the Rolls-Royce name and logo was sold to BMW for £40 million as a direct result of the recent Aero Engines joint venture with BMW. BMW decided to end the contract of supplying engines and components to Rolls-Royce. The contract stated it would be cancelled within 12 months' notice. Unfortunately, in that case, Volkswagen was left hanging in the time frame to re-engineer the automobiles for newer engines was not adequate. Volkswagen sold the company to BMW. BMW took over in 2003 and the company became Rolls-Royce Motor Car Limited and officially began the manufacture of Rolls-Royce branded automobiles. Into the 2020s, Rolls-Royce is known to uphold its elegance. It is also one of the most reputed and well-known brands of luxury. From its innermost interiors to the outermost hood ornament, the spirit of ecstasy. The brand demonstrates pure luxury. Most popular Rolls-Royce models include the Cullinan, the Phantom, the Wraith and the Ghost with a starting price from $314,000 to $450,000 or more. Fast fact, if anyone attempts to steal or break the spirit of ecstasy, well, they can very much try, but they can't, because if this happens, it will automatically hide inside the bonnet of the car. Groovy. Before we get to why Rolls-Royce is the most luxurious car, and if you reach this far, we thank you. Make sure to hit up the subscribe button and give us a thumbs up. Why do we say Rolls-Royce is luxurious? Get ready for some fast, fast facts. The new era of Rolls-Royce manufactured under BMW featured the Phantom in 2003, where most of the manufacturing is done by humans, handmade, instead of robots. More than 200 aluminium pieces and 300 alloy parts are hand-welded. The duration of the manufacturing process is at least two months. All parts from the colors, 44,400 colors, different blends and diamonds can be infused to the paint, to the interior and exterior bespoke and specially crafted for its new owner. The center logo on the wheels of the car never spins. It's always visible in a fixed position. Check it out next time when you drive past this exclusive automobile. The Starlight headliner consists of 1,600 fiber optic stars each hand placed to create the illusion of any constellation or any pattern in any color to give an impression of stars in the roof lining. Rolls-Royce even manufactures set luxuries and elegant accessories including a branded umbrella, specially made to match the owner's Rolls-Royce color to precision. The interior of the Rolls-Royce is crafted with bull leather from only bulls from Europe as the higher altitude protects them from mosquitoes and insect bites, minimizing the risk of bite marks. On top of all the luxury, only one man paints the stripes in all the Rolls-Royce cars produced. Since 2003, using squirrel hair to paint the stripes, this is entrusted to only one pair of hands, Mark Quartz. Talk about luxury. Make sure to comment down below which model of Rolls-Royce you would like to keep in your garage. Make sure to check out this inspiring video.